I assume that at some level all technologies have that capacity to to make something that we never imagined before. I'm always trying to work with things to find out what that is. What's the, what's the secret potential of this technology? What can you do now that you could never have dreamed of doing before? Bloom came out of a little experiment where it was just creating a shape on the screen, having it expand and disappear. Really, it was just a very simple tech demo. There's something quite charming about it quite instantly. The Music X Tech program is about empowering artists to create and experience music in new ways. With Peter and Brian, we had the opportunity to take their application Bloom into mixed reality. The first big difference is scale. To be in the middle of it is an entirely different experience. This is my first toe in the water with augmented reality. I like this thing of still being in the world with another experience added to it. I think it's a bit of a sense of magic, actually. Being able to actually touch something in the air and see it become a real thing in front of your eyes. I know how the technology works, but I still find myself running after these things in the air, trying to touch them. They seem so compelling and solid. It really is truly mixed reality. It's blurring the lines as to where one starts and one ends. One of the things I've always liked with Bloom is that it gave anyone, regardless of any experience of music, the ability to feel what it's like to be an improviser. In this situation, you're not on your own. So you're in a sort of orchestra here, rather than being a soloist when you have the app in your hand. It's quite magical, actually, where two of you start creating things in the space around you. I don't think anyone's experienced anything like that before, actually. <laughs> 